What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Fish with Colton. Today, we sent out some jug lines and the bait we're going to be using is worms, uh, catfish bait, and chicken liver. Our chicken liver is kind of frozen right now so we're letting it fall out. But we're going to see which one of these uh, can catch more catfish and uh, yeah we're going to get to setting them out. We already have three of them set out so we still have seven more to do. So we're going to get these set. Alright, sitting in 13 foot of water. We got worms on here. This one's going to catch a 35 pounder. No doubt. I mean, what catfish does not want to eat worms? Send her on down. Later, little dudes. Kind of rookie at this. Still learning. On the bottom. One rep, two rep, three rep, four rep, and boom. 35 pounder right there. You just wait. This one we're gonna use. This we have to put red on. We have one white one out, but we're gonna put this one on. The next one's gonna be worms. But if you guys we leave in the comment section which one you think is going to catch more catfish. Will it be the red kind, the white kind, worms, chicken liver. Which one's going to catch more and which one's going to catch the boots? I don't have my scale on me so we won't know. So don't. That stinks. I'm going to stick it through the hook. Tip of it off so uh, you can get it in this mouth. This is not very professional. I ain't this. One, two, clean off the hook. We're setting in 14 feet of water. That in, that in, drop this down. And wrap it until it gets to the bottom. We're on the bottom. Just take it through that thing. Wrap it around your centerpiece. And you're good to go, just like that. Alrighty, for the last one, we put a mixture of red and white on here to see which one they want more. We kind of moved in a little bit to 11 foot of water. We just had the ones out there to see if we can get any roamers sitting out there. Moving in. So we're just going to see which one they want more, the red or the white cubes. So, that looks not professional much. Oh, gotta clear all that up. Boom, all done. Alright, so this one has one on it because when we were pulling up, it started taking off to the middle. So uh, we're gonna ease our ways up there to it. We're gonna use the old net to grab the. Uh, no, I ain't gonna grab the circle with that. I'm gonna grab it with my hands, see how big it is. Oh, 
Ooh, he was on white. Got us a little baby blue catfish. He's talking to me. He's saying I need you. Alright, there's our baby blue catfish. It has something off it. Looks like it's blind, no? I don't know. But there's the first one of the day. Alrighty, so we are back. We did some crappie fishing. You guys ought to see that video, see if we caught any. But we're back over here checking the jug lines. We have one right here that's over. And looking down, we have another one that's tipped over. So we're gonna see. Yeah, it's like quite a ways down there. Yep. Mm -hmm. There he is. On chicken liver. Second blue catfish of the day. Just talking. So we're gonna stick this guy in the cooler. Alrighty. Well, it's been a couple hours and what wrong? Chicken liver. Don't like it. Just keep it. Keep it. Yeah? Oh, he's a little bit. He's still got meat on him. Mm -hmm. Alrighty. Here's the third catfish. We're right here in this little guy. Another one, red one. There's another one right there too. So hopefully this one has a big one. Well, I feel the head shakes. for this video so this is the first time I've been juggling fishing on Grand Lake in a very long time so if you guys made it this far you guys are the real ones and if you guys want to see more jug lining hit the like button so we so I know you guys want to see more but most importantly hit the subscribe button we're on the road to 700 and yeah leave a comment down below what you guys want to see next for the videos and I'll catch you guys in the next <music>